Yeah, this is Margaret in Windsor. Hang on a minute. I'm trying to get this in the stand here, okay? I don't want people just to see my nose. Hold on a second. I hope this goes up. I'm not sure. I don't have a stand, and unlike the people I'm referring to who took everything, and uh, my father's Edward VIII. He never married Wallace Simpson. He was married to Claudia Ruth O'Keefe, Windsor, Madison, Wisconsin. I have put this up with plenty of proof. If anybody cared to look and know that I couldn't possibly have made this up in living in the poverty, sheer poverty that I've lived in all my life because of these, this fake monarchy, I have to wonder Every day since uh, August the 3rd of 2013, in the condition I've been in, broke, kept with that, uh, any money, lived on the Appalachian Trail. You won't admit all this and the shame that's involved unless it go be goes before a world court. And um, so that you don't think I'm babbling, let me cut to the chase here. I was kidnapped by these bunch of thugs, the Illuminati, your Rockefeller, Rothschild, Bilderbergers, the Kennedys. And when I say JFK Jr. came up on the mountain here at uh, Roanoke, out from Roanoke, I resorted to freezing and starving on the Appalachian Trail. People were told not to help me, to keep off the side of the road from being raped. And I've put all this up. It's over and over with enough information. You could check most any of it out. It might take a little money and a little time, but at least you wouldn't be going around calling me names that one day you just might have to pay for. Maybe there's someone who can make you pay for it. I haven't lied one time. Um, Elizabeth's father helped take down my dad. Never, my dad never married Wallace Simpson. He would not go along with the Illuminati. And people can come in here and try to cut it to pieces. It's the truth. Uh, there would not have been an, a United Nations if it hadn't been for them taking down my father. He, w he would not sign treaties. So all these treaties that were signed... Uh, he would not okay them, and people, well, anyway, I'm not going to go any further. It's either told here in the end, and, um, you know, I've put it up here, and there are some very nice people, okay? There's some where I wouldn't be alive, and I have to wonder why people want me dead. I've told the truth. You're taking up for, I'm not going to say a family, because there's some that, have in the past and are probably still trying to help me. Uh, maybe they're not visible to everybody, but some of them I know have helped me and are trying. I'm going to say this. When I started on, was it Facebook or YouTube? It's Facebook, I believe, which has been 2012. Yeah, in about March on Facebook. And... Uh, <laughs> You know, bear with me. I believe I am correct that he, f came, the photo came up, and God knows I don't want to get him in trouble with the Illuminati or all these nice family members. That <laughs> I'm the one that should be ashamed to call them my family. Okay, uh, but anyway, this uh, he was king, an elderly, and he came up, and I don't know that if he asked for me to friend him, he came up there. It was a big picture. I remember that. It showed him. And in the message, I don't think that needs to, ma to matter if I friended him or he. he uh, and then he wasn't there any longer. I can't remember where he was king of. It was a smaller place and um, country. And he said to me that, um, I don't remember, I'm trying to, I, I have done 
tell the truth throughout this and to have some people be so utterly shameful and disrespectful for no reason at all other than to hurt and cause pain for someone who's been in pain all my friggin life since age two in the kidnapping by this bunch of thugs sitting up there calling themselves royals this uh man was king and he was elderly and he uh, come back to me, whether I friended him or he friended me. At best, I can remember, he just kind of showed up there, his picture and everything. The thing is, that he said he could not help me. He would not go up against the Windsors. Well, it wasn't, so somebody could go and check this. It might take a little time. He was king over a small, smaller country. or, um, But his son, he... Uh, abdicated a little later I mean it hadn't been that many years ago between the between the time that I got that and that he abdicated and his son became king it wasn't that long maybe a couple of years if that so it can't be that hard to check out if you care to check it out any of it could be now I have looked at uh, this picture I put up of Lizzie Borden if you don't know who Lizzie Borden is, maybe you'd like to look it up. Oh, uh, she, Elizabeth, and all her glory and her bouquets and the bowing down to and all this, she's a criminal, cold-blooded criminal. She was 15 years old when I, her father helped in my kidnapping with Roosevelt, Roosevelt in 1939. My father had moved back in because he had made arrangements uh, because they forced him out with character assassination. He never married Wallace Simpson. If anybody in their right mind stopped to think about it, someone who's got that much power, these people that control your banking, uh, you would say, wow, we need to do something about this not attack me, not take my father and mother down, and do to my children, heirs after me, what's been done. Not one person has ever paid for the crime. It's ongoing. Now, Elizabeth is part of the Illuminati. She always knew about me, so she had to have been around me. In fact, there's been a thing about a cup, and this isn't it, okay, right here. But um, it was a... a cup and I do remember uh, about that because it was a big cup and it had Victoria the second on it Queen Victoria the second that's who I am the minute I was born my father had made legal uh, legal arrangements and it went through proper channels so the minute I was born I'm the legal heir whether you like it or not why on earth would you attack me I'm the victim in this, for God's sake. These people don't even represent the British, the Empire. They have squandered it, let it go, while they uh, soak themselves in wealth. And they have always known about me. I was kidnapped out of one of the castles. I remember the, the cup deal where they were attacking my father, and I can remember on this side of me, and it was on the mantle, and they were, uh, it had to have been George, Elizabeth's uh, father, was who it was, attacking my father because the cup was up there. So my father had come back because he signed papers, had them signed when they forced him out. Um, that if he had an heir, the heir would not be disinherited. The heir would uh, inherit, and I did. And then they had to get rid of me. They thought they were rid of my dad, so now then they had to get rid of me, and they did. And here I am. I'm 80 years old, the best I know. I am. I remember being placed there and what I looked like, and all my pictures were uh, until school books and... um. <laughs> I was told by a British lady that uh, that was the what she told me. I understand that now I look back, they always knew where I was uh, when I was kidnapped and brought there. 
And people want me to explain why didn't they bring me back. Well, you stop and think about it. I can't even go home now. Uh, and I might be booed because of the friggin' lies, and it doesn't matter about my dad. You've been mesmerized by this bunch of thugs, and I don't mean everybody because I've had people on the trail. I've had people when I was almost murdered that are Brits and Germans that saved me. Uh, so sad to see people look up to this bunch of war criminals that are traitors to them, actually. Now, I'm trying to get back to, uh, let me see where I'm trying to get back to in all this. It doesn't seem to be uh, help me putting this up. Um, I can't get an attorney to touch anything. I have uh, a policy that I should have had that somebody else has probably squandered a long time ago. I Legal aid I cannot get even though they should and required. Civil rights. Uh, when I was in that campaign and flown out to Mr. Flint's uh, in 83, I had turned uh, information at that time over to, to uh, civil rights attorneys there. What happens is when I would apply for a job or try to uh, garner any help from attorneys or anything, someone would come in behind, and I don't know if they said uh, about ongoing investigation and invoked, um, um, well, I don't know. But they'd come in and they'd get my resume and get the information I left. Now, I don't know if they could have done this everybody I took it to, but this was my money and my hell that I was going through. And I do hope that it's poured out there in front of the world and all these people who are loving this rotten family there, and I'm not calling them all rotten, but Elizabeth and that family and uh, her mother, and uh, don't tell me about mothers. My mother was the mon uh, Queen of England, the Queen Mother. And how people can sit by and adore because of the money and the power they got. They don't care how they got it. Well, I look at uh, how Elizabeth's children have married. And I look at all the, then the grand, then her grandchildren. I look at how it's filtered out into society. They've married into wealth and everybody is mesmerized by how charming uh, <laughs> they look. Of course, they aren't getting uh, on a table getting lobotomized and they're not uh, taken to another country, and which my mother's from this country, my beautiful mother stripped from both my mom and dad, thank you, family there. Oh, uh, you don't want to see the... Now then, this is where they would say, oh, you're not fit to be queen. Well, I am, and yes, I am fit. You're to calling the wrong person not fit. Uh, I walked, and I literally did, through shit. Now, if you want to take this down and call me unfit, uh, you better wash your own mouth out and... Look at the people you're supporting, because if you really think and believe there's God, uh, a just God, then you got to be Looney Tunes if you think he's going to take up for this family and the Illuminati, which he talks about in Revelations, I'm told. And he does. In fact, I had a policeman. I'm not going to tell you what had happened to me. I've told it before. This family sitting over there, with my money and position, have have uh, distributed the wealth out to where if I came home, this lady this and lady that, and queen this and king that, and their siblings and their blah, 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 is so out there in links and webs till, you know, <laughs> I could get stoned to death trying to come to my home I did nothing. I was kidnapped. I love my country. And if you call this babbling, I don't know. I'm probably talking into it. I can't tell because somebody gave me the wrong stand and I got back. And anyway, I don't have the money to go replace it or the way to go to the store. I, I'm limited. <laughs> I don't have any money. I'm a pauper. Um. Anyway, you get the gist. There was... um. 
<laughs> um, someone who, I, well, I've just put this up and I'm getting, he's got plenty of friends. And yeah, I, he's, he put this up. It's his, there's things I know that if they come to a close, it's going to make me so happy. I so happy people when this is all thrown out and people choke on it. That's called me names for simply telling the truth and not caring because you know I couldn't make all this mess up. And here I'm still trying to defend myself and hoping my babies, my children are still alive. You should be after this family and protesting them, not bowing down to them. Why they have not at least reached out a hand to help me. They stole it all. They're supposed to be my cousins. Lizzie Borden's my cousin. Her husband is my cousin, just like he is to her. And by the way, I don't like saying that. Uh, I'm not proud of them. So, when you talk about unfit and you talk about end times, which that, not just me saying it, uh, I had some a policeman approach me and I started to tell that. And this was in Lawrenceville, Georgia, when I had a uh, had long list of coming from your President Reagan and turning a book over. My book, that's where my book, one copy went to Ronald Reagan and a letter from the FBI and a uh, couple of letters from the FBI and, and uh, documents in it and on the front of it, and I turned it over to Reagan's son, uh, Michael. He had the lapel on, and I was up there carrying this book and and what I had done to me and what Henry Kissinger had done. Why do people think it's okay to do this to me? I was a baby. My father did nothing wrong. He is one of the greatest men and so... Uh, lied about, and this stinking family is up there, and I bet you this is not going up, so I'm going to roll it up here. Uh, it's not doing me any good anyway, I don't suppose. There's few good souls out there, but it's really got to go into a world court, and guess who controls it? <laughs> yeah, It'll look at where it's located in Henry Kissinger, who had me laid out on the table. That's on the 18 and a half minute gap. Uh, to lobotomize me, and that ain't the first or the last time they tried. So uh, this family, uh, as far as Elizabeth, and I hope, I hold out hope that some of that family might, are not crook, crooked and got into this plot to take down my father. Well, most of them are dead, but anyway. So I look at the way they've intermarried and all this. All of it throughout the United Kingdom, and um, I, you know, I hope that some of my family up in the Netherlands are not. Let me put it this way: are not like Elizabeth and that bunch of thugs, and they can wear their gowns and their jewels and uh, laugh. And I don't know. I hope there's a reckoning. And I hope if there's God and Elizabeth feels free to walk into church and uh, where on earth does she think if she believes in God and believes he's a just God that he's going to take sides with her? Oh, I'm sure that's not all I meant to say and this is going to go off and it usually makes a racket <laughs> When it's going on, I can't see and I have to take it down. In other words, the camera's on this side and my button to push is on the other one to start it. And I can't see it. Can't touch it without taking it down. So this is part of Murphy's Law, I guess. Anything that can go wrong will. Uh, so anyway, in case this is still going up, I put a video up, and I had all kinds of trouble that I have never had before uh, after it, and I might say that I'm looking at the television now, and it's having some kind